The Black Widow movie has a big head scratcher moment when Natasha is apparently skydiving with no parachute, but Marvel's Avengers game might have spoiled what's next in that moment. BD here, and since we haven't been getting new Black Widow content, we're all left with the months old trailers and the footage which shows Natasha skydiving with no apparent destination other than the ground. However, if you've played Marvel's Avengers, which came out earlier in September, the answer might be spoiled for you. At the end of the Black Widow trailers, we see Natasha falling through the sky as some sort of giant structure is also crashing down around her. What is this giant structure? How did it get so high in the sky? We're not gonna dive into that because your guess is as good as mine right now, but maybe that's a separate video. In playing Marvel's The Avengers, there is a clear aha moment which might reveal what Natasha is doing at that point in the movie though. In Marvel's Avengers, Black Widow jumps right off the Golden Gate Bridge as though it were a cliff on Vormir, but she doesn't go crashing down into the water. She catches onto Taskmaster who is fighting her and her super pals zipping through the air with a jetpack, and then she safely fights him to the ground on the bridge. In the Black Widow movie, we know Natasha really can't die because this is set before Avengers Infinity War where she was very much alive. So she's probably headed down through the sky to latch onto Taskmaster, fight him or her through the air, and maybe even make an effort to try to catch Florence Pugh's Yelena Belova. Something tells me Yelena is also crashing through the sky and Natasha desperately wants to save her first family. Who knows if it's going to work out though, because where was Yelena during Infinity War? Is she dead? That's another video for another time too. We've already seen Taskmaster hit some dance moves previously performed by MCU characters like Black Panther, Hawkeye, and Captain America. A jetpack would put the villain right in line with Iron Man and would also support the theory that photographic reflexes are the result of leftover Stark tech being found by the villain and inserted into the Taskmaster suit. We already made that video, so drop a comment if you need a link. Do you think Natasha is skydiving onto Taskmaster's back? Are you ready to jump to any conclusions? Are we diving too deep here? Drop your thoughts in the comments or send them my way on Instagram at Brandon Davis BD and head over to comicbook.com slash Marvel for more updates. If you're watching us on YouTube, be sure to subscribe and let us know what kind of content you want to see. So I read those comments and I want you to enjoy our stuff. I'm BD, I'll see you there.